Yeah, he takes away, he takes some things from Mortar, he takes other things from Kroos. With the pressing, it's more Kroos. I think he reads passing lanes kind of like the way Mortar does, because the way you said, like the way he positions his body, Mortar is an expert at like, he presses you, but also closes the, pla- closes the passing lanes behind him and also ushers you into the space he wants you to go, go to. And then obviously they get suffocated and then they, they lose the ball. Odegaard, I don't know if you saw, this was kind of a recent tweet. It, it was like a few hours before the podcast today and I retweeted it. It was uh, via Mark Carey from The Athletic. He had posted a graphic of Arsenal's pressing since Odegaard, Odegaard arrived at Arsenal. Oh, I didn't see this. And uh, it was super interesting because it was basically, it basically show, showed that um, the entire team has had an uptick in their pressing, but also he leads the entire team in that metric. So pressures... Uh, per 90, Odegaard is number one on the team with 21.9. Smith Rowe in second with 16.8. And Odegaard's successful pressures are 30%, which, you know, successful pressures are a little bit hard to, to decipher because ultimately it's not always you who succeeds in pressing. It's a collective effort. So you may, you know, it's, mm-hmm. it's the whole the whole goal of it is like eventually Domino. in the sequence yeah. in the buildup, someone will lose the possession. So, um, so they've had an uptick in their pressing. And like, you know, the whole thing, like, it's so funny the way we, we actually care about this stuff and that, like, you know, we look at Odegaard off the ball. He's pressing. He's pointing at everyone. He's like, go there. go Like, he's ushering his team. He's, he's marshalling the team where to go. And in a way, I almost feel silly about, like, even looking at that stuff and considering it. But at the same time, it's actually real stuff. Like, it's like the whole team presses better with him in the team. And um it's super interesting to track so like the that part of it is definitely like it's the Cruz aspect of like Cruz is an awesome presser but not so much when when it comes to tracking so 